So inflation is going to happen no matter what. Huh. If you increase the money supply, um, you get inflation. Right. There's, no, there's not some magical cure for getting rid of inflation, um, except to increase the productivity, the output, output of uh, goods and services. So if you say, like, like what is money? Um, you've, got, you've, got, you've got these sort of, um, it's basically numbers in a database that's, uh, uh, that, that sum up to some, uh, come up to some total. Then you've got the uh, output of goods and services of the economy. And the, it, as long as the ratio of money to ratio of, of, of goods and services stays, if that, if that stays constant, you have no, no inflation. If, uh, if you add more money, if you add money to the system faster than you increase uh, goods and services, right. then you have inflation. Um, so all of these COVID sort of stimulus bills uh, were not paid for. They were, they were just generated more uh, currency, more, more, you know, uh, more, more money was, was, was created because the, the, the federal government, uh, the checks never, the, the, the checks always pass, uh, you know, until, unless you hit a debt limit, which there's probably going to be some debt limit crisis later this year. But uh, provided you haven't hit the debt limit, the the federal government, uh, unlike state governments or city governments uh, or individuals, can simply issue more money, um, and that's what they did. Um, I mean, as old saying goes, there's no there's no free lunch. If you could just issue massive amounts of money without negative consequences, why don't we just take that to the limit and make everyone a trillionaire? Well, well they, I mean, they tried that in Venezuela. How that how that work out? Well, they had to eat zoo animals. Right. It's not good. You know.